first question similarity and dissimilarity between constitutionalism and constitutional morality you can simply let's say that ki such it is a direct question so direct question when you have first question so anything you can write as introduction you can simply say that ki both constitution constitutionalism and constitutional morality are inspired by system of constitution or a system of constitutional governance and then we can go on writing similarity right similarities between them or it is first it is better to write this similarities so you can write the this similarity constitutionalism and constitutional morality so we can talk that basically the main difference between this it is about limited government so it it is about limited government it is not about limited government it is about let's say that ki uh, people those who govern those who govern and those who are governed it's let's say ki both should have reverence to the constitution it represents the morality of the people those who govern let's say constitutional morality we can say it is about limited governments it limits the power but it it is about uh, respect reverence to the ideals of the constitution we can say this this hence it checks basically absoluteness it let's say results into an enforcement of constitution and that way you can see some other points written so main thing is to tell you the difference the constitutionalism is about limited government it tries to uh, uh, eliminate a system of absolute government so idea came that okay, this is how a written constitution so idea came from a written constitution when us us constitution was adopted so the idea of constitution has given rise to constitutionalism because a government should be run as per the constitution so government will be limited but constitutional morality if you say on the other hand the constitutional morality is the morality behind constitution why that constitution we have brought it indicates the morality of the framers of the constitution first second we now we have the constitution so then it is about the government and the govern they should have reverence to constitution some of the rights should be given to the citizens and we should respect whatever let's say that both government and the govern should respect constitution whatever the constitution we have adopted and this constitutional morality has been let's say so extended or interpreted by recent times supreme court in sabri mala case in nowdays case constitutionalism is promoted when any such state exercises absolute power you can say that ki governors presidents rule ordinances when such type of things are struck by the court so it is trying to ensure that there is a constitution there is constitutionalism and it is trying to eliminate arbitrary exercise of power but constitutional morality when we say we are trying to protect ideals of the constitution like say secularism can be one such ideal equality can be another ideal justice can be another ideal so that is how the differences we can say but at the same time they have similarity because they may support each other constitutionalism will come when we have constitutional morality and constitutional morality will come when we let's say that have rule of law when we let's say that the government which is governed by constitutional system and that is how you can see and that is how the idea let's say that and the purpose of giving this question is that we have been expecting a question already constitutional morality they have asked we have been expecting a question on constitutionalism mm -hmm.